friends welcome back to my channel organized with joy as you can see today here i am again in my closet how many closet clean out videos can i make but if you remember the last time i did a closet clean out it was last spring and i decided to take a bunch of clothes that i was on the fence about and put them in a box and store them in my attic for a while to decide if i could live without those clothes and I decided today is the day, it's been about six months for me to go grab that box and go through that stuff and decide if I'm gonna get rid of it for good or keep it. I probably will make a pass through the items that I, I currently have in my closet as well as I have um, definitely purchased new clothes since that last closet clean out. Also, I might remove some items from this closet and move it to a different location in my home. I have some ideas for that, especially for things on my husband's side. Um, as usual, like I always say, I do not declutter my husband's things, so I will just be straightening up his side of the closet. I almost asked him this weekend if he would want to go through his clothes, but then I chickened out. I know he's not a huge fan of decluttering. It's the yin and the yang of us all. <laughs> so yeah, I'll just tidy up his side, tidy up the closet in general, but I d definitely wanna go through that stuff that I stuck in the attic. But in addition to that, I am going to go through my jewelry as well today, specifically my um, earrings and necklaces. So that'll be a part of this video as well. But without further ado, let's get into it. You know, there's kind of part of me that doesn't even want to look at this stuff. I do remember some of it. And I've actually thought about going in the attic to get certain things. And then I was like, that's too hard <laughs> to climb in the attic to get it. It's not worth it. So maybe it's not worth it to keep it in my closet. I think I'm gonna go through it anyway. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay, this may be harder than I thought. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Okay friends, all of these shoes, I'm just gonna let go of them. I know that I have too many shoes and there's one pair of boots in here that I really like but they are uncomfortable and I'm trying so hard to just let go of clothes that are uncomfortable. I'm too old for that anymore. But I will show you, this is the pile of things I still wanna keep. I know that some things I just put in here because they're more like winter clothes and I knew that I probably wasn't going to get rid of them. Um, like these corduroy pants, I wore those last year and I still really love them. Um, and I still really love this top. Um, it's like a velvet top. I love to wear this like around Christmas time. So, I mean, I don't wear it often because it's such a distinct piece. But anyway, um, these are the things I'm keeping. I will show you in a minute here what I'm going to just go ahead and donate and then I will get into the rest of this project. Tell that story when we first met. Help me remember that day. Cause 
I'm reaching for something, something to believe in. Something else I want to do today is switch over my summer stuff for fall winter stuff. Um, it's kind of ironic that I chose today to do this because the high is 96 in Austin. But um, I can still grab my sandals. I'll show you in a bit where I keep all of my um, shoes that are out of season. Um, but I have been grabbing my um, other season shoes quite a bit within the last last couple of weeks because we are getting cooler temperatures in the morning and I really think we're headed into cooler temperatures soon I think but I'm gonna go ahead and get this done some days are fire some are cold as ice it's nothing we did not expect when it's hard love just remember cause it's so damn easy to forget your eyes so We'll be 
In addition to switching over my shoes, I'm also switching over my shorts to my jeans. I have a drawer in my dresser where I keep the off-season item. In the fall and winter, I have my jeans in my closet so they're just easy to get to. And in the spring and summer, I have my shorts in here. Okay friends, I've been trying on a few clothes um, to decide if I wanted to keep them or not and um, I didn't show you all of them, but I decided maybe I should show you some. Um, obviously I would not wear these earrings with this shirt, but I think the issue with this shirt and the next one I'm going to try on is I feel like they're maternity shirts or something. Here, I don't know if I can, it's like so big. So. I'm tucking it in here. I'm tucking it in like this. I think I particularly don't like it with shorts. I don't know, it's like an awkward ratio, I guess. But I don't know. I think this is made for a different body type than mine. So let me know what you guys think. Okay, this is the other one. Again, would not wear these earrings with this. Um, maybe it's patterns that I'm not liking. Um, it is cute, but again, I feel like it's too big for me or something. And every time I put this on with shorts, I don't like it. And this one you can't really tuck in. Because that looks weird. Um, so, I don't know. Let me know. Again, a pattern. Here's the last one that I'm on the fence about. I love the cut of this one. If this one was like a more neutral color, I would definitely keep it. I kind of just want to keep it for the cut, but again, let me know.
Okay friends, now is the hard part and that is my jewelry. If you're new to my channel, you might not know how much I love leather earrings. So I have quite a few, quite a collection that I've been collecting. Literally, I think the first pair of leather earrings I got was like 10 years ago. And I've been collecting them ever since, getting them as gifts, whatnot. Um, I'm primarily cleaning up this space. It just, it needs to be dusted. I like to rearrange all the earrings so they fit better on, on this um, chicken wire thing. But maybe, maybe I can declutter some. <laughs> I decided for this video to film it a little bit more vlog style where I was talking to the camera more or talking to you, I guess. But let me know what you think about this style of video. I've been doing this periodically on my channel and that's only because I really enjoy seeing it with other people's channels. It just makes it feel more personal and it makes me feel like I'm more like their friend and I'm in their home. So I hope that you felt that way today and let me know your thoughts on it. Okay, friends, in addition to the pile I showed you before, I'm getting rid of these clothes as well. Some of them were actually ones that I had saved um, from that box and then after trying it on, decided that I was gonna go ahead and get rid of it. And then others are just ones that I chose today from my wardrobe to get rid of. And this is all I have to declutter of my jewelry. I'm really struggling to let go of jewelry, so, um, I guess this isn't bad. What is this, like five, six pieces? But anyway, that is my, what I'm decluttering. Well, friends, that is all I have for you in today's video. I realized that I'm still struggling to really get my wardrobe downsized the way that I kind of want to in my mind, but I'm trying to give myself grace and knowing that I work better just with baby steps and just trying different things. And so I'm just going to continue down that path. But I hope today's video gave you tons of motivation to get a space in your home cleaned and or organized and decluttered. And I so appreciate each and every one of you who watches my videos, especially if you're here until the end. And if you are new, I hope that you enjoy this enough to stick around and subscribe so that you can see future content that I post. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.